Hi Virgo, let's see immediately what is your card for this reading. Three of Swords, unfortunately it is a hard break there, a painful ending that still is in your memory, you are recovering fast, but you still think about that ending. There may have been some blockage as well, some real blockages or uh, problems with communication. But let's see now, let's start with the reading. Uh, this is a general love reading, so it may or may not resonate with all of you. Let's start and first let's shuffle the deck four times. Let's start with what is the current situation, what are the current energies? Thinking like that connection is over completely, not wanting to restart it because you know the truth, you, you have all the panorama there, all the facts that make you believe that it cannot be repaired. But let's see what happened in the past, in fact, what was the main challenge? Problems with communication and uh, feeling alone many times in that relationship. Feeling not appreciated. Uh, there may have been some overthinking as well that made the connection slow down and not progress faster. What is affecting you in your subconscious that you may not be aware of? If you should take action or not, if you should wait more to heal or if you should jump immediately and take action towards them to change the situation because you still have attraction there. So one part of you wants to take a break and heal, the other part wants to take action and give attention again to that situation. How do you view that situation? Let's see more details. You think it was toxic, unhealthy? You want to avoid being stuck in a position where uh, there's no perspective, where there's no progress. It feels like uh, there were many different opinions and perspectives about many things there. You could not agree on many things. It was not easy. Your hope is to find a more mature partner, you want stability, something long-term and serious. Yes, you want that attraction as well, but most importantly, you want something serious. What about them, this person that is currently in your mind? What are their energies towards you? They are not doing much. They think that uh, connection cannot be successful long term. They are very guarded, they have lost trust, but they haven't given up. They still believe it is unfinished business, but they are not doing anything. They just reflect, they are taking their time, not doing much practically. They're just overthinking a lot. Yes, they overthink a lot, but they overthink about those conflicts, arguments that happened. They haven't given up, but they feel hurt and have lost trust as well. I will continue this reading in the extended with more details about them, their feelings, how they view you, what are their intentions for now, and the mutual energies and so on. If you want to watch the extended of this video, you can find it now in the description box below this video. See you the next reading and bye for now.